Hey everyone, it is October 2nd and I figured I would just vlog a little bit today and tomorrow and kind of do a mashup of the two days before I leave. I honestly cannot believe that I am going abroad for five weeks. <laughs> like what? How? Like I, I honestly, I don't know how like, this is happening. It's crazy, but... It is a Sunday. I leave Tuesday afternoon, so I have a lot to do between today and tomorrow. Like packing, yeah, like might be a good idea to at least bring my suitcase upstairs. <laughs> but it's crazy. But I'm gonna film videos today. I am going over to my boyfriend's house tonight to have dinner with his family like my little goodbye dinner. Oh my God, that is gonna be so sad. Going over there and saying goodbye to him, but oh my gosh. Yeah, I don't wanna think about that. It's like, ugh, I've been such an emotional wreck recently, but yeah, I am going to be filming some videos, so you'll get a sneak peek of, or like a preview of what's to come. I have, Let's see, what am I doing today? I'm gonna do, film at least, my project pan, like my skincare and body care project pan update. I'm gonna do an empties video, a sample, like I'm gonna call it sample Sunday, maybe. It depends on when I decide to actually upload it, but it's like a sample based empties, so I'm splitting them up. Obviously, the video that you'll see either before, well, no, it'll probably go up right after, like after I, I leave, um, is like a video talking all about my study abroad program and kind of like what my plans are and what I'm doing over there and yeah, so that's kind of the plan. I have to go to Best Buy to get an Ethernet cable adapter because my MacBook does not have a plug for it. And I also need to go to Ulta. <laughs> like, I actually need to go. Um, I'm going to get two things, which I will show you. But, yeah, just kind of thought I would bring you along with me um, for my last two days here. Kind of show you what I'm up to. Packing. Oh, my gosh, that's going to be a nightmare. I'm sure I'll have some interesting footage for you then because, oh, I don't know how it's going to fit. I it's now 2.42. Clearly I did my makeup and I have filmed two videos. Yeah, like can't remember. Oh my gosh, I am like obsessed with how my makeup and hair look. Just like my whole entire vibe, like my whole room right now, like yes, this, yes. <laughs> but I'm taking a break to edit two of the videos. I filmed my project pan update and the video all about my trip. So I'm going to edit and export and upload those today so I know I have those videos ready, but I still have my empties videos to film and I still have my errands to run. The empties won't take long, but I needed a break because like my throat was starting to get like, you know, like when, well, not everyone knows, but like when you do videos for a long time, your voice just like goes and it's weird because it's different than just talking normally because like I feel like I'm louder and like I don't, I don't know. It's just like my voice just like disappears when I film so or gets really, my throat starts to hurt. But yeah, just thought I would update you just chilling on my bed with my little babies. Hey guys, it's the next day and I'm currently importing some videos from last night so I can edit them and have them uploaded. But yeah, I am in the process of packing right now and that's interesting. I actually don't have as many clothes as I thought considering the fact that I'm gonna be gone for five weeks. So I'll show you everything I have laid out. So these are kind of like, these are my pajama pants. So I have three pairs of like pants and then a pair of shorts. I have kind of like a longer tunic style sweater and two nice sweaters, some like tank tops, some 
I have some t-shirts because I'm not sure how it'll be. This is kind of like a mix of stuff. Then I have two pairs of jeans and a nice pair of pants because we have like a school visit. And then a lot of pair of leggings. And then I have this black cardigan which is a little bit longer, kind of nicer. And then two Patagonias, the green and the cream. And then I just have a bunch of thin long sleeve shirts. So the thing that's the most difficult, well, besides the shoes, which I'll talk about in a second, but the thing that's the hardest is that like, I don't know exactly how cold it'll be because like, I don't have a reference point at the moment. Like it's gonna be, I think in like the fifties, low sixties, but obviously it hasn't been the fifties here in a while. So like, I don't exactly remember what that feels like. So it's hard for me to determine like, okay, is that just a sweater? Like, could I just wear a normal, you know, sweater like this? Or is that a tank top, a long sleeve shirt, and then like a jacket type pullover? Do I need more? Like, could I get away with just wearing a pullover? I don't know. It's, it's really hard to say because like I, can't be like, oh, okay, well, it's 50 degrees here, so I'll just go outside and wear that. And I'm cold a lot of the time, too, so, yeah. But the shoes have been the biggest overall struggle because, like, obviously, for the most part, I'm going to be wearing just, like, my tennis shoes, like my Nikes, but for nicer outfits, because I don't want to look, like, ugh, hideous every day, you know, like, in total bum clothes, there are going to be days when I'm traveling and maybe like when I want to have pictures taken or whatever or when we're doing like nicer things that I'll want to, you know, wear jeans and like a nice sweater and I'm not going to wear like sneakers with that. I would rather wear like booties or some sort of boots, but it's just really tough because like we're going to be doing a lot of walking and if any of you girls have any like little booties, like ankle boots or even tall boots, they're not comfortable. Like, wow, I sounded really Southern in that, ew. But like, they're not the most comfortable, you know, they are not meant to <laughs> be walked like miles and miles in. So I'm not really sure. I have like these tall boots. These are like my favorites because I can wear them with leggings and they look really good, but they're not my favorite with like jeans and nicer things. I just don't like I really don't like tall black boots with jeans. I feel like they look weird. Brown boots are fine, but the ones that I have are like all busted up and I'm not bringing those. And most of the outfits that I'm bringing anyway, like the nicer things, these are kind of like my nicer kind of tops, like those two sweaters. Everything's kind of interchangeable though because like these just plain long sleeve shirts are nice. They're like all from loft, so they could be worn with jeans or whatever. But I don't, I just don't know. And like I have my combat boots, but that's not really the vibe I'm going for. So I have these that I just got. They're from, I believe, Steve Madden. But I'm trying to see if they're comfy or not. That's why I have on these hideous socks. Don't worry, I would not wear them with these. But they're kind of like a stone color, so... They would kind of go with like the brown and the like gray and black tones. I also have these, but I, again, I'm not crazy about the way that like these really short ankle boots look with jeans, which is crazy because like what other shoe, like what other pants would I wear them with? But I'm not sure. Maybe I'll just have to like try on my jeans. But also, I don't know. I just don't love the way that the black looks with this. I think like that kind of tone goes better. I don't know. But then like most of it looks good with black. I don't know guys, I'm really struggling. I don't know what to do. I think I'm just gonna end up taking a pair and then getting some like insoles for them to make them more comfy because I definitely wanna take those tall black boots but they are not comfortable. Like they are not meant to be walked in. But anyway, and I need to get a scarf. Oh my gosh, this, my closet is horrendous. Oh gosh. But like scarves are all the rage in Europe apparently. So gotta find one. Oh, my blankie. 
my baby blanket. <laughs> okay. I do not know what I'm gonna bring. Oh my gosh, this. Oh, this is the perfect thing, but this is so thick. See, I'm just like mad struggling because I really don't know how cold it's gonna be. Like, can I wear just this like little flimsy scarf or are we talking like a big, thick wool scarf? Ugh. My friend Rachel got me this one. It's from Urban. It's like a nice black and gray. This is super warm. Oh my gosh, they're like all tangled. But I don't know, like, is this like too much? Like, how cold is it in the 50s? Surely it's not freezing, okay? We're not, okay, I'm, I'm not going where it's snowing. Okay, that's like over the top. I really like this one. I'll probably take this. I've worn it a million times. It's like a, one of those loop scarves, but it has like a little bit of like a fake fur, so. I don't know. I guess I'll take this to throw on if I need to. But yeah, I'm like mad struggling. I don't know what to do. This is really tough. I just got back from Home Goods and Target and figured I would show you what I got. So, like I said, I needed a suitcase. I think I said that. The one that my mom had was like way too small. So, I went and got this one. Clearly, this is like my favorite color. I love the burgundy. And then I got a bunch of other things. Super fun stuff. Please note the sarcasm. So I got a nice gray neck pillow, some blister things, band-aids, note cards, because I'm um, obsessed. There's a few random things in here. A mini of the Dr. Bronner's Magic Soap. I use this to clean my brushes, Beauty Blender, and Clarisonic, so I needed a small one. Some insoles for my boots, a scale, like a, um, a luggage scale, some of these compression bags, these will be interesting to try, and then a random thing that I got at Home Goods is this little sign, because it was five bucks, so I thought it was cute, but yeah, so, yeah, and Indus came with me. I had to go with her. Yeah. She's so, not a good chopper. Uh, She's a good shopper. She's not a good person to shop with. I gotta figure out where I'm gonna put this. Maybe I'll put it like over here. Oh, that's cute. I don't know. We'll see. But now I have to pack everything into <laughs> my bag. And as you can see, it's a lot of stuff, so those compression bags better work. Wow, I look totally orange, but I am finishing packing up right now. It's really crazy to like actually be getting everything together um yeah i still have a bunch of stuff like laid out but that's what my suitcase is looking like so far got like textbooks and crap <laughs> but i had to like wash all my makeup brushes and everything so i've got all of that stuff toiletries laid out so I kind of have to like wait to fully pack, which is annoying, but obviously that's how it is. So yeah, it's going well. I can't believe that I'm almost like ready to go. It's so weird. Like I'm not even, I'm not nervous or anything today. I'm, I think it's cause I'm still so busy, but I'm really excited. So yeah, I think that's about it. I'm pretty much ready to go and I want to go ahead and like edit this maybe tomorrow or something but yeah I hope you all enjoyed this vlog and kind of got to see what it was like for me to prepare for the trip um if I do any vlogging you will see it but I have videos up pre-filmed and they are scheduled so you will see them I am so proud of myself that I got those videos done and yeah I hope y'all are having a fantastic day, and the next time I see you live will be either during or after my trip, which is so crazy. So I will see you all then. Bye, everyone.